into the video, I want to tell you guys about my new Patreon that I just started, where you can donate money at any amount to help save the channel, and to also help build the quality of my videos for you, loyal fans. I will leave a link in the bio down below, in the description down below for more info. Click on the link and donate any amount that you want that will help me and you build a better channel and also save the channel at that being as well. Now, enjoy the video you guys. Peace out. Action Action Nation here with the Royal Devon segment. And I missed you guys. Let's react. That's what we do best. Today we are here to react to the top 10 most insane pulls you will not believe exist. This is with the S at the end. And please hit my Patreon and help out. Somebody said it's all about the money. I hardly doubt it's all about the money for me. I never had a Patreon. I had to get a Patreon to save my YouTube from being took down. So if you have something negative to say, don't say it at all. Or at least try to say it to somebody else, but I'm bring it to my channel, okay? Now, let's do this reaction video. Do me a favor, hit that like button down below, hit that subscribe button down below, also hit that bell for more notifications from me, it'll come to you. Also, let me know what you want me to react to next, and I got you, fam. Hashtag R-A-N. Now, let's get right into this reaction video, you guys, because I'm tired of waiting, and I know you are too, but let's go swimming. And welcome back to Top 5 Central. Today, we're looking at the top 10 pools you won't believe exist. Now we've done like water slides and roller coasters and a few other things, hmm. but when researching those videos we found a lot of insane pools too, so I thought you guys would really love to see that. Right. With that said, let's see if we can smash 10,000 likes on this video, and if we can get Ooh. that, we'll start doing the You Won't Believe Exist series every week again. But with that said, let's get right into it. Number 10. So most people either want to go somewhere beautiful or somewhere dangerous when they go on vacation. That's this somewhere is beautiful. the perfect mix Woo. of both. The Devil's Pool is right on the edge of the Victoria Falls, which is literally the highest waterfall in the world if you didn't know. Whoa. I'm not even joking, you literally have to pay to go, but you can't go higher for yourself than Niagara Falls. Reasons. However, being honest, it's worth making the trip anyway. Oh. Just from this video alone, that's, a pool? Tell, that's one of the best views in the whole world, and there's nothing like it anywhere else on the planet. Oh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. I'm not getting I'm not I'm not getting copyrighted. I do it like this. Now, nature has created some pretty crazy places. Whoa. There's no beating humans when it comes to making absolutely insane places. Whoa. I mean, Nemo 33 is the deepest indoor swimming pool for diving in the history of the world. In fact, it's so deep that it even has fake caves built in halfway down. So get ready for this. According to the people who built it, it's 113 feet deep. But the good news is the water is still pretty warm, so you don't need like a dry suit to go swimming down that far. The bad news is, well, it's also used for professional divers and even underwater film shoots, so good luck booking a slot within the next couple months. Mm. The bad news is, well, it's also used for professional divers and even underwater film shoots, so good luck booking a slot within the next couple months. Where a double entendre that. What's up with the music? I, I, man, I don't want to keep turning this down, dude. Oh, what are they doing? Dude's clearly not talking about it. He's introducing it, then he's introducing a video of music. Like, I don't understand that. So if you go to a luxury hotel and spend a bunch of money on it, obviously you're going to want a luxury pool to go with it, and this right. one is pretty much as over the top as you're going to get. Marina Bay Sands Sky Park has the world's longest elevated swimming pool, and it's literally the height of luxury. It has like a vanishing edge and an insanely cool view, but if you're still convincing, it gets even better. Literally, the moment you get out of the water, you're surrounded by rooftop celebrity chefs and exclusive oh. nightclubs. Oh, and did I mention, there's even a freaking observatory deck with 360 views of the Singapore skyline. That is, if you can afford it. That's crazy. No music, no music, no music, no music. Whoa, that's, that's dope. That's dope. That's tight. 
I can't do it like Death Cole and Jody's corner. That's tight. I can't do it. We pull on top of a building. How about that? We swimming in here. Yeah. I can't swim. No, in fact, I have a story for you after this video. If I can tell it. Whew. Number seven. Wow. I mean, it's kind of common knowledge that most people like their privacy, but do you think you'd ever go this far? So to give a short explanation, a group of architects made this house with a pool on the roof in the Greek islands, and I've got to be honest, the reason why is pretty crazy. So the whole house is either hidden under the pool or built into the rock, and the pool itself acts like a huge mirror, so the whole house is basically invisible. With that reasoning aside, the pool also has a more normal job, since it's absolutely huge and perfect for swimming, especially because there's nothing else to do for miles. Number 6. Now this pool is mostly pretty normal, but their way of helping guests get around is pretty unique. Wow. So there's like a splash pool, it's like a Miami river, pool, and some other standard stuff in the Grand Wavy Pool, but they also have a water elevator. Now what? I know what you're thinking, it totally doesn't sound like a real thing, but it's actually really cool and not hard to grasp at all. Basically in the activity pool, guests just have to hang on to a big metal column, and as the water rises, so do they. That's I mean, tight. honestly though, I think the stairs would actually be quicker, but who cares to walk upstairs when you can literally just float your way to your destination? That's tight. That's dope. Like all the way risen. They can rise to the top in the water. I've heard of bar stools in the water before. Number one, all right? How are we going? Oh, oh, music, 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 music. Lazy River. So if you were looking for a place to go on a super relaxing retreat, you probably wouldn't think of Utah, but it turns out they got something pretty cool to offer. The Homestead Resort has a 70-foot sinkhole with naturally heated water, so the water is warm all year round. Now I know what you're thinking. A limestone cave might not be the most traditional place to go swimming, but it pretty what? much does everything. Like, you can even snorkel or scuba dive as close to the bottom as you dare. Not only that, but for a cave, it's way more pretty than you probably expect, so there's no reason not to go. Oh my gosh! I'm sorry you guys. I keep turning this down because I'm not trying to get copyrighted. And they keep playing music left and right. I think I may take this video off because I don't want to get copyrighted. I cannot get any more copyrighted videos, dude. I have four back to back. I'm not trying to make this the fifth. Just pay, play, play the sounds of people uh, swimming instead of playing music. Number four. This is okay, sucks. so Bali is already one of the most beautiful places on the planet. To be honest, this might be one of the most gorgeous places in it. Like you can easily tell, there aren't any crazy gimmicks because the Hanging Gardens Resort is completely surrounded by forests. So chilling in the Infinity Pool honestly makes you feel like you're right there in the trees. I mean, if you're looking to relax, it's pretty much the best place for you, and if that pool is too high, there are loads of smaller ones a bit closer to the ground. Oh. With all that said, though, if you're afraid of heights or if you got vertigo, this is so not the pool for you. <laughs> this dude's doing this on purpose, man. I promise you. Man, look at this, man. Wow. Look at the view, though. Woohoo! Look at that view, though. Look, I'm, look, I'm watching a freaking commercial for homes. You remember those shows used to come on? They used to show each home and how much they were and how much they were and stuff. I think it was called Homes for Sale. I don't know. Crazy show, though. Real pool, but it's basically impossible to tell the difference. So this pool is actually an illusion created by an artist for a museum a few years back, but it's insanely convincing. Like even once you see the people breathing and talking on the floor of the pool, it still feels like they're underwater, and you can even see the surface of the water above them. Like it's so clever that I'm just dying to know how they made it look so real, but at the same time, I'm gonna leave the magic live for you guys to figure out in the comments below. How did they make it look so real? Do you think real? there's like a really thin sheet of glass or what? I mean, I bet one of you are smart enough to figure it out.
Thank you. Such a music. How did they make that? That looks tight. It like literally looks like they're underwater. <laughs> oh my god, man. Number two. That was dope. Okay, if there's one thing cooler than a natural pool, Woo, look at that. Right next to an ancient city. It kill in Mexico was a sacred site for the Mayans that they used for relaxation, but a much more creepy fact is they also used it for ritual services. Bro. Nowadays, there are no rituals there, just small waterfalls and vines all the way down. Okay. You have to share the water with a huge black catfish that still live there. So yeah, if you can handle the fish and being 85 feet below ground level, it's actually pretty beautiful, as long as you can stop yourself from thinking about the horrifying Mayan rituals you're swimming right above. Whenever you hear music come on, you're gonna hear it lower. Cause I can't I can't get copyrighted on my channel no more no. I apologize to the viewers, but we didn't come here for the music. We came here to see the beautiful landscapes that are going on. Not to get copyrighted. Wow, that's pretty. And look at it's sponsored by Red Bull. Oh, Fun fact of the day, people have always gone to swimming pools to help their skin, but normally they bathe in like mud or clay. Ugh. I mean, even when things get a bit more crazy, it's normally like wine or coffee people decide to swim around it because that's supposed to help their skin the most. Right. Now, I don't know about you, but I've never heard of a beer pool before, especially not one that's supposed to act like a sauna. With that uh. said, people still seem to love swimming in it, even if it's mostly too warm or bitter to drink. But if you need another excuse to try it, apparently it leaves your skin filled. And there's a video on the top 10 pools you won't believe exist. Yes. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to leave a like down below. I want to say I did, dude, but you kept playing video. music. Also, if you have your own top 5 or top 10 idea, feel free to leave a form in the description to submit it.